Let's see. Okay, ready? Shh. One, two, three. I'm Josh Raymond. Caleb. This is Tessa. Fair. This is Katie. And it's time for the burn. That was, that was cold, bro. Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Tyler Payton, and it's September 21st, 2012, and it's time for your morning announcements. Thanks, Tyler. I'm Sarah. And I'm Krista. Today is National Tradesman Day, and to learn a little bit more about it, we go down to the CTE wing. Take it away, fellas. We're here today to talk about uh, National Trades Day. You know, to talk about communication skills and listening skills and uh, safety in the classroom. And yeah, we did a presentation, me and few other guys in my class and I guess he thought it was pretty good. Uh, we pretended like we was OSHA safety inspectors, got all dressed up and we talked about safety harnesses, hard hats, what's wrong about them, what's right. Uh, this is called a safety harness. Okay. You put it on for when you're on the scaffold just in case if you fall and it will save your life. Uh, this is a scaffold. Like this one, like if you ain't got the handrails you gotta Take this lanyard and get tied off. Uh, good morning, my name is Cody Smith. I'm here in the shop and I'm gonna show you how to properly put on a safety harness. It's gotta be snug on you so it's not too loose and you could possibly rupture yourself or then your lanyard is on the back, which you, like Frank said earlier, it's gotta be tied off when you're six feet above. It's got to be tied when you're six feet above, so when you hit the ground, it <laughs> kind of keeps you from hitting the ground. Uh, I'm mainly looking for the trade of framing because all my family has done framing, and it would be an inspiration to me to get certified in framing. Right now, I'm real not. I'm not really for sure. I'm trying to just get certified in as many like as much stuff as I can. Uh, right now, I like. Laying block, it's pretty good. Framing, I like it. It's electrical, whatever, I'll do it. I'll give anything a shot. These guys, uh, they stepped up Monday and, and spoke in front of their classmates, and some of them done it for the first time, and they done a great job. And uh, we decided to, uh, you know, talk about some of the good things that happens uh, around here. Invite you down and let let their peers see, uh, you know, see what they do. And uh, I'm I'm really proud of them. I just want to remind y'all today, if you know anybody that's in the trades, just uh, thank them for what they do. Appreciate what they do. And uh, this is my instructor, Shane Messanger, uh, our building instruction teacher. And I just want to thank you for what you do for us. You know, you teach us every day everything you know, and it, it helps. It, you know, it prepares me for when I get out of school and hopefully land me a great job in one of the trades. And that's it. The country skilled craftsmen should be proud of their incredible skills and talents and deserve to be recognized for their hard work. Here at The Grind, we say thank you. Makeup pictures are Monday, October 1st in the Auxiliary Gym. Juniors, sophomores, and freshmen, if you want to order pictures, please fill out the order form and bring money that day. Seniors, no money is due October 1st, but you will receive proofs. Ladies wear a spaghetti strap cami and gentlemen bring in a dress shirt, tie, and jacket. We'll have a few, but we can't guarantee that they'll fit or that you'll like them. These will be the only pictures to appear in the yearbook and the wall composite. The PSAT will be given at LCHS on Wednesday, October 17th. Cost is $14 per student and fee waivers are available for eligible juniors. Students interested in taking the PSAT must register with Ms. Mullins in the counselor's office by Friday, September 21st. And now here's a word from the counselor's office. Hey, we are GIFT's Education Resource Officers, or HEROES for short. We are GIFT's biggest fans and we're here to encourage you to go to college. Did you know that West Virginians who attend some form of post-secondary education are far less likely to become unemployed than those who don't? Did you know that it is totally free to submit for FAFSA, free application for federal student aid, to see if you qualify for free money to help pay for college? Did you know that anywhere in West Virginia, a four-year college is anywhere from $3,000 to $7,000 a year? Did you know that going to college in West Virginia is affordable? 
especially with financial aid, scholarships, and your family's resources. Did you know that students who complete a bachelor's degree earn on average a million dollars more over a lifetime than those who stop education after high school? Did you know college is just more than a four-year degree? College is also a two-year degree and a certificate program. Did you know that by 2018, 49% of West Virginia jobs will require an associate's degree or higher? Hey seniors, did you know that College Application Week is October 1st to the 5th? Our goal is for every LCHS senior to apply at least one two-year or four-year degree program. Seniors will be going to the computer lab during English class to apply. See you at the poll is next Wednesday at 9 a.m. Everyone is welcome to attend, so come on out and join in the fellowship. FCA Marshall Game Day will be October 27th at the Marshall UCF football game. The price for the event is $30. Permission slips are available in Mr. Ice's room, 2109. The, the football, football team plays away tonight at Nitro, so if you are planning on traveling tonight to support the team, please be safe and let's go, go, let's go Panthers! Panthers. All right, Panthers, don't forget to check us out on our YouTube page or tweet at us at LCHS Pride. Remember, don't use your cell phone during a school day. This is how it's going to go. I'm going to talk to them, and then I'm going to turn around and I'm going to appreciate you for what you do, teaching us every day, everything that you know. <laughs> See what, look at how my hair is turning gray. This is why.